YouTube channel. If you are new here, my name is Ellie. Please hit that subscribe button to join this little fam. Um, so today's video, we have got a Poundland haul. I have got two bags full of really useful things that I've seen at other places that are a lot more expensive. And I thought, yes, I'm going to do this haul as a bit of a tips and tricks. Yeah, of like Poundland basically, like things you don't realize they do. Or in fact, I didn't realize they do. And they are like really useful things. So if you want to see what we've got, then let's get into the video. guys I've got my cup of tea I am in Ellie Darby vibes right now I am wearing her angel wear angel angel collection I've got the lullaby long cardigan and the what is it not called that I don't know what it's called oh god I've got the cardigan and then the crop on and the joggers so my cup of tea Kylie made by lovely Greggy and we are going to get into this haul so I can't remember what I've got because I did this shop a few days ago. I've just been non-stop working. So I know I've got like loads of little, little bits of bobs. It's going to be really random. <laughs> Let's go with... First thing, I'm going to do a really interesting thing first, I feel. The first thing I got was obviously some stationery. I absolutely love stationery. This year I'm really into my diary, like planning goals, like writing things down I want to achieve and then like ticking them off. So in... um. Poundland, they do these super cute pastel coloured highlighters. Now, these were a pound, her lol, Poundland. But in like shops like WH Smith, um, these can cost like seven pounds for like a highlighter. So I was like, do you know what? I want these and I will use them all the time. I love like highlighting and like making doodles and making like my notes look pretty. Like when I um, plan videos, I love making like the little page look cute. So yeah, I love, love, love these. And I honestly couldn't believe they did them. So, got those. I then also got this cute little pen. There we go. So it's really cute. It's got like a little ball on the end, like so. And it's pink. And it's just a little roller ball. So you just twist the end. And I just think that is super cute. And I needed like a nice little pen. I've got a Swarovski pen. But obviously they're quite expensive and I hate taking it out of my flat. But I wanted to have a pen that I can keep in my journal. And this one, like, because it's got the end. You can put it in the top of, like, the spine and it won't fall through. A little tip and trick for you there. I then also got this um, meal planner. So I actually never write down what I'm having for dinner. Um, it's pink and, like, um, like a marble, pink and gold marble design. And it just has, like... Um, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, like the days of the week, and then breakfast, snack, lunch, snack, dinner. So I just thought that was really cute, and that I can actually plan what I'm eating. So when I go and do my shop, I know exactly what to buy because I am literally notoriously known for walking to the supermarket with Greg and literally being like, "Right, what do we need?" And he'll get really aggravated with me because it's like, "Well, surely you're gonna plan this out," but no, I didn't. So I actually thought, and the sticks on the fridge as well. So like, once you've bought everything, you can like stick this on the fridge and then rip it off so it has like loads of sheets in so I thought that was another really cute little thing so moving on from stationery um something we all need at the moment because it is in you know middle of winter and all it's very icy outside they do these really cute little ice scrapers I thought these were really cute you get them in a pack of two one pink and one um black if you want to treat your boo to a present then Greg is absolutely like amazing this present because he has to scrape my windscreen so now he doesn't have to because I've got my own scraper they're really cute actually they've got like a soft um, mesh handle so that's not cold and yeah it's just my scraper so yeah thought that's a really good present okay so going on with the ice scrapers I also picked up this de-icer I just thought you know what I am like the amount of times I'll be late for work because I don't expect it to be icy outside and then I'm like oh, oh god I haven't got time to like, get all the ice off my car this like I've never actually used it before apparently I was asking Greg you spray it on and it like melts the ice so you can just quickly whip over your ice scraper and it's gone in like 30 seconds so this go down to Poundland and get yourself a bottle of that for a pound 
Brilliant. Okay, so when I say random, this is very random. So I then picked up these measuring cups. So you will see in so many online things, they measure things by cups. And obviously, if you're in the UK, like myself, we don't measure things by cups. We do by like kilograms, grams, that way. We don't really do cups. So these have the cups on and like teaspoons. So like half a teaspoon, teaspoon, half a cup. Like and then and then milliliters as well. So I just thought that's a really useful thing to have in your kitchen. And it's got um it's got pink and blue on, so I thought it was really really cute. Um, obviously quite useful. Okay, like staying on like the cooking side, I saw Poundland have the pink Himalayan salt in. This is really expensive. Like I, this is like a proper little hack from Poundland. Pink rock salt, like um it has like the Himalayan. Um, pink Himalayan salt in. It's really expensive and I use it in my cooking. I don't use normal salt anymore. I just use this salt. Um, apparently it's better for you. I haven't really done my research into it so I don't hate this for that. But um, yeah, I use it in my cooking. Um, and this is an obviously a pound. So I'm now going to get it. It's mixed with um, just normal sea salt but I thought it's still majority, majoritively pink. So pound I'm not gonna go spending four pound on myself and you get so much more like I just think if you use pink salt it's like literally pink get yourself down to Poundland I then also got the makeup wipes I basically don't I do not use makeup wipes for my makeup but I thought these were really really good to either get my just my eye makeup off before I then cleanse my face with my um cleansing scrub or like um if I have like a bit of like makeup that's like gone like out or like I need to like just get a wipe and just wipe it away I can do that with these and obviously they're only a pound um so yeah I just thought I'd get them obviously then if I spill makeup on my dressing table I can literally just quickly wipe it up with one of these I just thought they were quite um just safe thing to have in the drawer for like like and planned situations. So now it's like my boring bit, it's like my cleaning bits, but like I always get cleaning bits from Poundland because why pay more in a supermarket when you can get them for a pound in Poundland? So um, Greg, being as super strong as he is, snapped our scrubber in the sink, like literally clean in half. Don't ask me how, like muscles over here. Um, so I picked up two washing up brushes for a pound so he now can break one and we'll still have one spare so that's fine <laughs> and they're pink so why wouldn't you love them they do have green and blue as well if you are not into pink um i then also get Dettol wipes i did actually get some hate on these in my last video saying that they're bad for the environment i know they are bad for the environment but i do not go like cleaning my whole flat with them. They are purely for keeping in the drawer and having spillages. Because as you, well you actually don't know, but you will know in a few weeks when I do a flat tour. I live in a garage conversion. So my kitchen and bathroom are downstairs and then I live upstairs. So our lounge, bedroom and like area is like all upstairs. So like it's easy for me to put these wipes in that drawer there. And I can quickly, like, if like Greg spills something which he does and he like and will spill food I think just quickly wipe and then get it up before it falls like off the table so that is why I have those I hardly ever buy them I haven't bought these for ages um I do have my um Christmas ones still in my drawer but I, they have a really 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 Christmassy scent so I don't want to be using those anymore I'll then keep those for next year ready so these are now these last me like all year so just clearing that up <clears throat> I then just picked up some bleach Nice boring product, but you need it, and I always get it from um, Poundland. This is the Harpic Power Plus Citric Fresh, ten times better than Bee Leech. So it is really good, actually, like really, really good. So recommend this bleach. Last of all, I got some fairy washing up liquid. Uh, whoa, what a finisher! So um, I just get this from Poundland just because it's easier because I'm there. You can get this for a pound in any really supermarkets but I just find it easier to get from Poundland. So yeah, that is my last product. I hope that you really enjoyed this haul. It's a bit more of like a bitty haul. 
and a lot more like grown up bits but um i just thought some of the things i got i couldn't believe they were a pound and there's no point in spending more than a pound elsewhere on something you can get for a pound so i really hope you guys enjoyed today's haul and if you did please give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe if you are not already and i will see you in monday's video bye